Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm in love with a cold, 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 but anyways, I'm gonna get into the video for now, but make sure to subscribe if you have not already, and let's get into the video. Tana Mojo and Jake Paul. I've never liked Jake Paul. Jake Paul is just like a very, um, just a big no. Them together is just a big no. I think it's honestly a PR stunt. Like, I think they're just doing it for the clout. And their marriage looks so staged. It's just, it's just no. I mean, they're both the type of people to do things for views. Yeah, I just, I don't, I don't, it's not working for me, honestly. Sean and Camila. I think their goals, I've shipped them ever since they did the I Know What You Did Last Summer collab. But I don't think they're together. Like, I think their whole relationship is a PR stunt to promote their song Senorita. By the way, such a bop. Such a bop. I mean, I ship them, but I personally don't think it's real. So yeah. Shane Dawson. Shane Dawson is one of my favorite YouTubers. He's just so raw. He's so real. I love his docu-series. They're everything. I love Shane Dawson so much. <laughs> I think we deserve more Shane, honestly. I can't wait for his next docu-series. It's gonna be amazing. TikTok. <laughs> You guys already know how I feel about Musical.ly. I mean, it's basically the same thing. I used to have a Musical.ly. I'm sure you guys know. I just like to smile. Smiling's my favorite. Yeah. Musical.ly has always just been really cringy to me, but when they changed it for TikTok, like all these Musical.ly stars that didn't even do Musical.ly anymore decided to like, oh my god, TikTok is so famous now, so I'm gonna jump on and pop on the bandwagon like no no come on sis no you're you're trying to be relevant when you're irrelevant so like click up sartorius i know he's back on tiktok i think it's just dumb like come on no no musically used to be like a lip syncing app i mean it still is but it used to be like really cringy and now tiktok is kind of like you can make like really funny videos on it and i went back on tiktok because i saw all these tiktoks on my instagram feed like the explore page and i decided to go back on it just because it's fun but if you want to follow me on TikTok, I don't know, TikTok is just really cringy, like all of the slow-mos, all of the lip syncing, it's just weird. I say that, but I'm on TikTok. The Little Mermaid. All y'all little white people are all so triggered by this Little Mermaid. First of all, I love that what Disney's doing to like recreate the Disney movies. I'm very excited about, you know, the new Little Mermaid, especially being like a black girl. Like that's great. I mean, we don't have any other Disney princess to look up to except for Tiana. Now little black girls can be like, oh my god, I can be the Little Mermaid for Halloween this year. Like, I think that's so cool. So like, I don't know why everyone's so mad. Like, don't you guys already have like 50 other Disney princesses that are white? Like we have two, don't be salty literally don't even be self that's like it's no you really don't have a reason to be like don't even come at me because i will come for your neck the fur kink and i'm just gonna call them kink and bags i already i you guys okay i don't even know how to say this like i think it's swedish but the fra have it in kink and bags um i think they're really overrated honestly because everyone always gets the yellow everyone always gets the freaking pink like for why and it's for 80 it's just a backpack literally a backpack worth $80 and I don't even understand why it's $80 for nothing girls are always like wanting that backpack like for why for why I'm not gonna pay for $80 for a backpack cuz no ma'am no sir you know they have Jansport backpacks you can buy a Jansport backpack for 30 maybe $25 you know at the most and the last unpopular opinion for today is ice cream licking I don't even understand why People decide to lick ice cream. Number one, that's so freaking nasty. Like, why are you gonna open the ice cream and then lick it and then not even pay for it afterwards? Like, that's so nasty. You should literally burn in hell. That's disgusting. Like, nobody wants your freaking germs, first of all. Nobody got wants your AIDS that you have. And I think it's dumb that now stores have to put the little things, like covers on ice creams because of people licking the ice cream. Have you... Where is your- where are your parents? Like, I don't, I don't get it. I don't, I'm just not- I'm not here for it. Someone needs to get punched for that. But that is all for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys like this, make sure to like it. 
Also, make sure to subscribe if you want to see my face on your screen every single Wednesday and Sunday. And I think that's it. I'm going to go, and I will talk to you guys next week with another video. Bye!